All right, today we are making homemade lemonade. So you need about eight lemons, about two cups of sugar, and water. Three simple ingredients. So I'm going to take about four of the eight lemons and I'm going to zest them to the best of my capability. Before I zest the lemons, I'm going to roll each of them on a very hard surface for about one minute each. So these are the four lemons I chose to zest. So I went ahead and washed them off really good and gave them a good roll. And now we're going to go ahead and zest them. And your lemon doesn't have to be perfectly zested. We're zesting it for the color of our lemonade. So these are my four zested lemons. As you can see, some lemons don't zest as well as the others. And it just is what it is. And now we're gonna move over to the stove where we're going to simmer our zest. One and a half cup of sugar and two cups of water. So I've already added the two cups of water. And now here goes the one and a half cup of sugar. And last but not least, we're gonna add the zest from our four lemons. We don't want this mixture to boil. We simply want our sugar to dissolve. I'm gonna keep stirring until the sugar dissolves and then I will take it off the burner and we'll use this at the end of our recipe. As you can see, I've already juiced two lemons. I'm gonna show you my trick to juice lemons without a juicer. So all you need is your lemon cut in half and a fork. I will take the lemon and I will squeeze it in half. And as I'm squeezing it, take the fork and just ring it side by side and then squeeze as you, I'm sorry, and then squeeze as you go. And then we'll do it the opposite way also. So let's get to juicing. Eight lemons later, and a whole bunch of freshly squeezed lemon juice. Let's make our lemonade. All right, I have my little strainer, and I'm going to pour the zest and sugar that we made on the stove in right now. And now I'm going to pour in our freshly squeezed lemonade. Yes, we have a few seeds in there, but it'll get caught by our little strainer. Let's pour. I'm going to add four cups of cold water. And there you have it, homemade lemonade. My family is definitely going to enjoy this. Thank you so much for tuning in to Danielle DeAndre's Kitchen.